There are dozens of videos on YouTube of people messing around with turbo whistles, but nobody seems to be able to get them to work. Turn it up a little bit. But whoever greenlit this product had to have seen some kind of results on some car. So we're setting out to make a comprehensive list of every car it does work on. But first, I want to find out how they work. So how do these turbo whistles work? It looks like it is just a whistle. Could we have gotten that information without cutting in half? Probably. Who's to say? <laughs> It's just an aluminum whistle that funnels air in through the whistly part, and it's supposed to be from your exhaust, but I'm skeptical. You got a car here? Yeah. This is your car? Here she is. Have you no shame? What? It's got a real small tailpipe, and uh... We have to use the small ones. And it still doesn't fit, you just have to hold it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we could get her on there. Figure out a way to clamp it on there. Installed. Dude, is that turboed? That was beautiful. Did you get any of that? <laughs> Confirmed, they will work on a moped, but sounds a little chirpy. I think we can do better than that. Next up is Palmer's car, which is funny, because it's a Civic. It's fitting. I would race you, but my mom said I could. Oh. There's its dirt start. Stick that up in there and oh, it'll work. Give it the beans. Mm. Get ready for these breath, baby. Nothing. Give it some more beans. Looks like Civics can't be turboed. Fact. Next up is my truck, which in my opinion is the coolest car in this parking lot. My only concern with this is, uh, look at that restriction. I didn't look care. That exhaust pipe. Oh. Yeah, that thing is, that's how they came, you know? Just like all rusted out. take it back the coolest car in this lot is my truck is that kidnapper van over there okay yeah that wins oh we need something else we can stick it on okay, where's your dirt start there it is okay <laughs> so if you've got a Toyota forklift, it will work in that at low RPMs. So that's like uh, all the cars that I personally know. Uh, can you go find some more and just uh, try it out? We need a we need a bigger sampling. Yeah, okay. Meanwhile, at the crusty crack. Oh man, I should go look for some cars now. But first, I need my music. Radical Hit Clips by Trusty Wired Earbuds. What could possibly go wrong with wires dangling close to my neck? <laughs> Oh no! If only I had wireless earbuds! Presenting Raycon's Everyday E25 Earbud and its co founder Ray J. Don't be sad, be happy with Raycon's and their seamless Bluetooth pairing and six hour battery life. It's no wonder celebrities like Snoop Dogg and Mike Tyson are obsessed with Raycon. Raycon earbuds come in a variety of colors and are free from potentially dangerous wires. So you can have peace of mind when you're using them while doing summer things 
like putting turbo whistles on mopeds. So get yours today by clicking on the link down in the description or by going to buyraycon.com slash waterjet where you will also receive a 15% discount. And with a 45 day return policy, you've got nothing to lose. And we'd like to thank Raycon for sponsoring today's video. Six and a half hours later. Wait a second. Is that a Hennessy Velociraptor Supercharged V8, serial number 46, hand built in Texas, USA? Oh, there's even a hole for it. It's like it was designed for these. Ah, that's about right. Now these ones say they fit most exhaust tips. Well, the truck definitely works. But what about a Mercedes-Benz S65 AMG with a V12 and two turbos? <laughs> Nothing. Well, this isn't the prettiest Mustang, but it's got a Pro Charger and she runs. The Pro Charger is like a supercharger, but different. No wheels, no problem. <laughs> Fire it up. <laughs> On the bright side, the Pro Charger kind of sounds like the turbo whistles. Okay, we've now stuck a rag in it. Let's see if that works. Still nothing. Oh, why don't we try this Lamborghini Diablo? Oh, oh man. Hey, I need this. This car? Yeah. Right now? Uh-huh. I'm halfway through racking this hood and you tell me you need it? You couldn't have come like three hours earlier? Uh, there's traffic. Well, it already has two turbos, but what if we added two more? Patrick, how much horsepower do you think these will add? A good 300. It stands to reason it's got two turbos right now, two more, you know, these carry the one, 300 more horsepower. Sounds about right. Give her the beans! No turbo? In conclusion, if you own one of these vehicles, by all means, get a turbo whistle. It'll be well worth it. But if you happen to own any of these vehicles, I'm sorry, but they just won't work for it and it just might not be worth it. Do you agree? Approved. Mitchell? How long has he been there? A couple hours. Ah, he's fine. He did this like a couple weeks ago, so we should be good.